It's a good night for volleyball here in Houston, Texas. Your Lady Warriors from Chris Cypress Christian High School will compete against Houston Christian's Lady Mustangs. Today you'll see Cypress Christian Lady Warriors in their navy blue unis with the black navy blue shorts. And on the opposite end, your Lady Mustangs will be dressed in white, lined in royal blue here today in their matchup against your Lady Warriors. Starting lineup for your Lady Warriors, that's Hensley. She will wear number seven, Williams at eight, Collison wearing nine, James at 11, Whitmarsh at 12, 14, that's Jans, 15, Roberson. The Lady Warriors are coached by Brittany Witherspoon. On the Lady Mustang side, you have Alex Mott wearing one, Sophia Beaver wearing two, Madison Krieger in three, Ella Drury in four, Victoria Crawford after that outstanding performance in the National Anthem, she will wear zero, and her teammate Carly Capuche wearing number seven, sung the National Anthem with her. Wearing eight, that's Abby Wilmont, nine, Emma Geld, 10, Casey Price, 11, KK Hill, 16, Maddie Kinney. In number six, that's Taylor Mackle. Lady Mustangs with the first serve. And just like that, Madison Krieger right off of the serve, getting the first point of the matchup here for the Lady Mustangs. So Krieger will serve again right to the front line. Bump set sent over. Spiked and blocked by your Warriors. Sent right back over, but then we, hey, we got a game of volley very early on. Slight tip, but out of bounds by Whitmarsh, and it'll be a point for your Lady Mustangs. Great effort by both of those teams here, but go up 2-0 right now for your Lady Mustangs. Sent right to the middle row, set and hit and right off of the block just like that we got a score for your lady warriors so as they making sure all the volleyballs are sanitized here have a clean game here serving by roberson for your warriors congestion at the net tip down from whitmarsh once again, being a force to be reckoned with here very early on in this matchup against your Mustangs. So we got an even ball game here. Sent right over Robeson to the back row. Set and saved out of bounds here. Backward set. Sent over by Jans. Set. Back. Block and ricocheted. One, two, and three over from Whitmarsh, but right into the net. Another point for your Lady Mustangs. I can attest that this may be a back and forth game all evening long, but don't go anywhere, folks. First to 25 will take game one. Set to serve, that's Capche. Bump, bump, set, but out of bounds for your Warriors. Couldn't control it there, so a point for your Mustangs. Carly to serve, sending it right over. Great serve by her. Bump, bump, sent over to Hensley. Forward set, smacked down by Mott, but received and retrieved by your Lady Warriors. Backward set, the trick play. Carly Capche, she can do it all, serve and play. And another point, making this a three-point ball game right now. Carly goes back to serve. Nearly missing the net here. Bunt, bunt, and sent to Hensley. Retrieved there. Great efforts by your Warriors. Man, the energy is high in here. I must remind you that it is homecoming week for your Lady Mustangs as they go into a timeout called by Coach Witherspoons, but don't go where, anywhere, folks, and we'll be right back after this timeout.
right back out of that timeout here. Great serve, but still the same game of volleyball here. A slight tip from your Mustangs, but sent over one hit one too many times from your Warriors, and that point will be awarded to the Mustangs. Great effort we're seeing by both of these teams right now. The energy is well and alive here. But Carly still in that serving position for your Lady Mustangs. Sending it over right to the front. And just the Warriors unable to control the ball there. So Carly will go back to that serving position, making this a six-point ball game currently. Complete dominance here we're seeing. Tipping the net but floating right over. Hensley will send it over on the third touch. Set, bump, quick set there we just saw from your Mustangs. But sent and double blocked right at the net there. That's Emma Gelt. And her teammate Taylor Mackel with the assist there. Great effort by those ladies. Carly serves it to the right side here. Forward set sent over, double-handed by Whitmarsh. Forward set, blocked at the net there by, that was Jens on that block for your Lady Warriors. So that point will be awarded to them here, making this a six-point ball game. But checking out of the game, that's Whitmarsh for her teammate Lucy Davis, a junior for your Warriors, checking into this ball game. Nice midpoint serve there, backward set. But not quite. The Warriors are able to respond. Slight tip. And it's able to stay inbounds. That was Hensley on the tip there for your Warriors. So Davis will serve once more here. Send it in midpoint once again. The quick sets is something that the Mustangs are kind of benefiting here. As we're seeing that time after time. Play after play. And. Warriors just unable to get adjusted and control the ball when it comes from the net from that quick set. But Mustangs right now up six points over your Warriors. A little too strong serve there by Carly ending her serving tenure. As we will have Faith Cullison, a senior for your Warriors, giving it her best efforts here in the serving position. Right rolls off the net and she's able to get the point. Mustangs not being aware there and Cullison able to get a point on the board for her team, making this a four point ball game. So Cullison, nice serve, better than the last. Slight tip, but ricocheted back. One, two, and three. Right over it goes. Mustangs backwards set there, but blocked at the net. Sent over, and it is in the bounds. That was Carly Capshay. I feel like we've said her name numerous times already throughout this call. And, man, her presence is being felt here today. But set to serve, that's Emma Gilds here. Sending it to the left side, right into the weak point of the defense of the Warriors. Taking her team up six-point advantage over your Warriors. Emma to serve once more. Sent right back to the same position. Forward set. Sent slammed by Hensley but rejected at the net. Here she goes once more. Presence is felt but God is there to stop it in ricochet. But sent right over. Oh man we got a game of volley. Backward set. Sent down to the middle. A little slow here. Sent right back over from Carly. Hensley. One, two, three. She does it and one some more. That's the perfect time of if you don't get it the first time, you'll get it eventually. And Hensley just aiming out at every opportunity she gets. So Robertson will check out of the game here for her teammate Whitmarsh checking back in. Serving now. That's Jans sent to the midcourt position. Forward set to Krieger. But retrieved and controlled by your warrior sent over by Jens. Forward set to Alex Mott. Hensley 
light tip, but right into the hands of Casey Price. S sending over here. That's Carly once more. Hensley just doing it all from that left side of the court, but out of bounds on that possession. So that point will go to your Lady Mustangs. Man, these ladies are giving it all they have right now. 13 to 7, but this game is just even across the playing field. Serving now, that's Alex Mott. Sending it to that same left side. But Hensley with a slight tip and finds a hole in that defense of Lady Mustangs getting a point for her team. So checking out of the ball game, that's Lucy Davis as her teammate Whit Marsh checks into a senior for your Warriors. So different position here we're seeing Hensley at. She will serve for your Warriors. Nice serve there. And a double touch by the Mustangs. So we'll see Hensley back in the serving position. So not only does she dominate from the left side of the court, but from this serving position, she's a force to be reckoned with. Up and over it goes. Forward set. Sent over by your Mustangs. Forward set, but look at this in that same position. That's Whitmarsh into the net for the Mustangs in a point for your Lady Warriors. So switching out the ball to ensure sanitation is being followed here in this matchup. But Hensley floating right over the net Hensley just on fire right now from this position getting her point her team right back into this ball game it's a two point ball game right now so Hensley once more sending it to that position quick set ricochet right off of the block sending over that's Whitmarsh with the slight tip here we go, a slight tip by Madison Kruger here. A little collision there, but no worries because Whitmarsh is there to save the day, making this a one-point ball game. And, man, these Lady Warriors are definitely fighting to get back into this matchup just as they are 13-12 to 12 right now, one point to give. Hensley with the serve, sending it to that same position every time. She's found a weak point here and one too many hits for your lady mustangs and now look at that a five point rally we just saw from your lady warriors to make this a tied ball game ladies and gentlemen don't go anywhere as we'll have us a word from our sponsors Five point rally back we just saw from your Lady Warriors against the Mustangs making this a tied ball game right now. And just a reminder, there are fans in the stands as this is a homecoming matchup for your Lady Mustangs here tonight on this lovely Tuesday evening. But man, some great volleyball we've seen thus far in this matchup. This is only game one if you're just not tuning in. My name is Paige Lawrence on the call. But just like this, Hensley serving to that sweet spot position that we've seen her serve. And look at this, ricocheting right off of the block. Whitmar sending it right back into position over the top of the net here. Sending it over into the net. Whitmar unable to complete there that will end Hensley's time and serving for your must your Warriors but she's done just an outstanding job there so on the Mustang side that's Ella Drury serving right to the midpoint here from and serve to Williams sending it over with a slight tip that's Carly Capshay sitting right at the net but three touches there great awareness by your Warriors and blocked by Williams there at the net. 
but sending it once more sending it over just a lot of tip ball we're going on right now but a backward set block at the net by Williams that made three blocks for her in that possession and man is she hyped right now so checking into the ball game for the Warriors right on schedule that's Jans for Cullison and Williams will go to the serving position but what an outstanding effort we just saw from her three blocks in that possession Safe to say Williams is fired up as she gives us a nice serve here, but tipped over right to Williams from the Mustangs. A lot of tip ball going on here in the forward set, but look at this. Whitmarsh. A little too strong there. Checking out Williams getting her some quick breather in, but it, she looks like she's amped and ready to go for this Lady Warriors in this matchup. Mustang set to serve. That's Krieger sending it over to the right back court. Forward set with Marsh there, sending it to the left side of the court. Good save by your Mustang sent over by the libero. Forward set with Marsh with the ricochet slam. Oh my goodness, Whitmarsh doing exactly what her coach expects her to do. Checking out of the game, that's Lauren Wishmar here as her teammate Chloe Robertson checks into the game. Can attest maybe that Lauren Whitmarsh and Cameron Whitmarsh are sisters here as the Mustangs looking to get back into this game with the, a kill for Emma Geld but not quite and blocked and ricochet sent over by Geld there Whitmarsh blocked at the net but just a continuous game of volley we're seeing Jan sending it over a forward tip almost an awkward set we just saw there but sent over by Hensley Mustangs one, two, and three, and is sending it to the backside, but these guys are not giving in. And a miss a footing for Cameron Whitmarsh, giving that point to your lady Mustangs. But right now, we're going back and forth right now. 16 to 15, Lady Mustangs leading currently. Great serve by Carly. But Whitmarsh with a slight tip. But a dive from Mott, not enough to get the ball over the net, making this a tight ball game once more. So Whitmarsh will come take a seat as her teammate Lucy Davis checks into this matchup for a serve to come. Right hand serve from Davis. Backwards quick set, but a little too much amp there for Taylor Mackle so that point will go to your Lady Warriors and Davis giving us a, another serve mm -hmm. sent right back the first lead change of the game as the Warriors leading and the add more to that lead two points now over your Lady Mustangs and it's crazy. We're seeing energy energy shift here in this matchup between your Warriors and Mustangs as Davis goes back to that serving position. Right hand serve ricocheted by your Mustangs sent over with the serve. Sent into the net by Whitmarsh. So that point will go to the Mustangs. Checking out of the game. Taking a seat. That will be Taylor Mackle here. As Victoria Crawford set to serve here. Right hand served by her. Forward set. Hensley. Ricocheted off of the block from Ella Drury. And that point will go to the Warriors. Keeping this a two point advantage. As checking right back into this game. That's Michaela Williams. The senior for your Warriors. Stand still serve. A little too strong there on that effort by Cullison. But man, this game is just as 
anyone's ball game as we have a one point game currently. Floating that one right over, but saved from going out of bounds. Roberson with the touch to send it over. With a side kill by Ella Drury there, but Hensley a bit too strong, sending it out of bounds, but a good look for them. So now we're back here at a tied ball game, 19 and up right now. As Emma Guild back in that serving position for your Lady Mustangs. Floating right over the net. The serves are just outstanding. Sending it over. That's Davis. Forward set. Tipped by Mott. Forward set once more. Hensley with the attack. Hensley just filling that sweet spot there. That's a dangerous look on the Warriors' behalf. As the Mustangs is unable to control that ball as it comes from the power behind that swing of Hensley's so checking out Roberson will come take a seat her teammate will check into but Jens is to serve here currently sending it backcourt backwards tipped here and Williams with the slight passive block on that turn, giving it a point for her team, giving them a two-point advantage over your Lady Mustangs. So sent to the backcourt forward, quick set there, but a great retrieval process from your Warriors. Williams sent that one over, sent over by Madison Kruger Mustangs, but Hensley, Sending it to the backcourt set by Price. An attack by Madison Kruger. But sent right back over from Whitmarsh. A quick set and a quick tip. One, two, and have to send it over on this process. There you go. Forward set, quick set from Ella Drury. And just like that, they're able to get a point on the board. Man, that duo of Casey Price and Ella Drury with the quick set and hit. It's definitely been a force to be reckoned with at the net for the Mustangs. It's been working in their benefit as Alex Amat will go to the serving position. It's a one point ball game currently. Davis able to control it here, but Hensley from the sweet spot finding it to the midpoint. Slight tip over by Kruger. Hensley with the kill in the ricochet. And just like that two point ball game Three points to 25 we have, but just some more to give as Davis checks out of the matchup and Cameron Whitmarsh checks back into this game. So Hensley set to serve. We saw her go on a 3-0 run earlier in this matchup. Sent over, floating over on that retrieval. Whitmarsh. Mustangs unable to control the narrative there, so Mustangs will lose a point there making this a three point ball game and we'll have a timeout from your lady warriors quick timeout here but we'll be back shortly Twenty-three to twenty in favor of your Lady Warriors right now, but just anyone's ball game. We've seen this game switch leads about three times already. But in the serving position, that's Bella Hensley, a stellar senior for your Lady Warriors, looking to give her point, her team these two points they need to get claim game one. So sending it over to her sweet spot, but it controlled and set it as Whitmarsh a bit too strong there in favor of your Lady Mustang so they will now get the time to serve it's a two point ball game still in favor of your Lady Warriors so checking into the ball game that will be Maddie Kennedy 
for your Lady Mustangs as her teammate Ella Drury comes and take a seat. Kennedy to serve. Sending right to the midpoint. Forward set to Williams. Williams with a quick tip. And it's sent right back over to the net and right into the blind spot of the Lady Warriors defense. And man, a one point ball game. The fans are erupting as you can hear. And Kennedy set to serve once more. Sent over. One. Two and over by Whitmarsh, but into the net it goes, making this a tied ball game. And man, we'll have a timeout call by your Lady Warriors, but energy has shifted here. Quick timeout, we'll see and come right back. They done made three minor errors. And they wasn't playing like that before that timeout. So it was smart for her to call that last timeout. Cause they was on fire. They, they was going too hard. Twenty-three even across the board. Lady Warriors, Lady Mustangs. It is anyone's volley game to call. But right now in possession, that's Maddie Kennedy set to serve for your Mustangs. Sending it over. Forward set. Sent over by Whitmarsh and able to get a point. And look at this. If they can get this next point, they will be able to claim game one. As Cullison checks out of the game here. And her teammate Cameron Whitmarsh checks into the ball game for her. So Williams set to serve. Here we go. Forward set. A slight tip, but not enough to discombobulate the Lady Warriors. A backwards hit over the net. Slight tip once more. Making this a big collision from your Lady Warriors. Making this a tied ball game right now. As Emma Gill checks into the ball game for her teammate Casey Price. Look at this tied ball game. Served over from your Lady Mustangs. Forward set. Set in control by your Mustangs as it was sent over and sent into the net. And a point for your Lady Warriors. But these ladies have to win by two here. So we'll have your Lady Warriors serve here as Robertson checks into the ball game for Lauren Whitmarsh. Set to serve, that's Roberson sending it to the back row by the Lady Mustangs. Forward set, Emma Gale, and then ricochets right off of the Lady Warriors. 25-point ball game right now, and man, this game is on fire. Fans erupting everywhere on both ends here, as we'll have Carly Capche give us a serve. Hensley with the setup, sent over by Jens. Emma Gill sending it over with a kill, but retrieved by Cullison. Sent over by Jens. Forward quick set by your Mustangs. But Lady Warrior sending it over. And a quick tip blocked down from Taylor Mackle on that play. A big play by her. So now in favor of the Mustangs, 26-25, need one point to finish this set off. Carly Capche with the serve, forward set. As Bethany Jans is able to get that point for the Lady Warriors, making this a tied ball game. Looks like we may never get that two-point advantage here in this matchup as Whitmarsh comes and takes a seat. And Lucy Davis Jr. for your Lady Warriors shakes into the ball game. So sending it to the back side of the court with a, a quick tip by your Mustangs. But Mustang player fell under the net. So it will be a point for your Lady Warriors there. So this may work in their favor here as Lucy Davis goes back into the serving position. They do have the point advantage over your Mustangs here. Let's see what they can give us. 
Davis with the float over. Backwards set, but over the net here. Then you have Jens with the smackdown, but retrieved by your Mustang. Sent over by Victoria Crawford. A great dive by Davis. And look at that. Hensley with a slight tip, but ricocheted. One, two, and three into the net. And your Lady Warriors will take game one here in your matchup against the Mustangs. Impressive. Miss, we have just saw from the Lady Warriors a great rally back after they were able to get that lead change in the midpoint of this match, but they will take game one. Don't go anywhere. We'll take a break in between these games. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, facts. Like this. And we're back for we're back for game two here after just witnessing your Lady Warriors take game one 28 to 26 in that matchup. The game was pretty much a back and forth all game, but just impressive athleticism we saw on both ends of the spectrum for your Lady Mustangs and your Lady Warriors. You know, throughout that matchup, we saw Coach Witherspoon of the Lady Warriors just really coach her girls up when she felt like they were in fatigueness. And now we're seeing them go into this game, too, with a little bit more confidence for the Lady Mustangs. But look at this, a slight tip and a ricochet over the net. And refs are going to call the Warrior player making it under the net. So that point will be in favor of the Lady Mustangs, giving them the first point of game two. This is homecoming night for your Lady Mustangs, so they're in it to win it for their home crowd as you'll hear the roars come from them throughout this matchup. But a serve sent over from your Mustangs and them just really trying to get this game here, not letting the Warriors go up over them. But look at this, a nice game of volley, backward set, awkward set sent over the net here as Whitmarsh Trying to find that sweet spot, but ricocheted right off of the player. Mustangs unable to control it. So that point will be advantage of your Warriors. 
So checking into the ball game, that's Lucy Davis for Cameron Whitmarsh, and she will go into the serving position. Davis with the right hand serve, but sending it too far to the right, so they'll be out of bounds. And that point will go to your Lady Mustangs. So checking into the ball game, it's Carly Capche. She will be serving. No subs on this play. Nice right hand, powerful serve by her. Sent into the net by Davis, giving that point to your Mustangs. Here, three to one advantage over the Warriors. So Carly Capche set to serve once more. And an out of bounds serve it goes. The ball flies, and Williams will check in for your Lady Warriors. For Bethany Jans, but set to serve. That's Faith Cullison, a senior for your Warriors. Sending it over to the left side. Williams sitting at the net but missing that tip. Davis sending it flying and uh, with the tip by Hensley but not quite for your Mustangs. Sent into the net. A good look for Carly Kempche but not enough to send it over and that have a tight ball game for your game three and up here. So Faith Cullison set to serve once more with the right hand. Sent up by Carly and up and over by Kennedy Maddie so right into the hole of the defense of the Warriors, giving them an advantage over the Warriors. So checking into the ball game, that's Ella Drury for her teammate Taylor Mackle. As Victoria Crawford will serve. Sent to that midpoint, right into the net, but sent right over and a block by Williams at the net. Making that four blocks for her. A missed attempt by your Warriors. Giving that point of advantage to the Mustangs. So set to serve. Victoria Crawford. Right handed serve. Right into the hands of Cullison. Forward set. Sent over by Jens. Trying to save the process. One, two, three, and over. Sent up by Davis. Forward set into the hands of Hensley. And with speed and power, Hensley's able to get a point for the Lady Warriors. So set to serve. That's Melody Jens. Sending it over up. Set and slight tip, but tipped out of bounds for your Mustang. So that point will go into your Warriors. Up and over for your Warriors. Forward set and sit, but sent over by Kennedy, but ricocheted off the block from Williams. And that will be a point for your Lady Mustang. Served a server error there for Emma Gelt. So that point will make this a tied ball game. As checking into the ball game, that's Abby Wilmot. And also her teammate Casey Price checking in for the Lady Mustangs. As Hensley for your Warriors will be checking into the ball game. Hensley sending it over. Sent over by Maddie, a little too strong there, so there'll be a point in favor of your Lady Warriors. Sent over by your Lady Warriors, just like that. Hensley, now 3 0 from this serving position, giving her team two point advantage over your Lady Mustangs.
Sending it over to the backcourt. Up and set. Abby Wilmot with the tip over. Sent over by Whitmarsh. Ricocheted and uncontrolled by Casey Price. So that point will be in favor of Lady Warriors. This is the biggest deficit we've seen thus far in this matchup today. As Hensley still goes to serve. Controlled by your Mustangs. Tipped but rejected at the net by Williams. Make that five for her. So a four point advantage as we'll have some subs on your Lady Mustangs end. As Carly Capshade checks in for her teammate Ken Kennedy. Sent over by Hensley once more to that sweet spot. Quick set there and tipped by Jens. And that point will be in favor of the Mustangs. So now your Lady Mustangs set to serve. That's Alex Mott. Alex Mott with the float over. A miscommunication on the Lady Warriors in and a quick point for Mott. Mott to serve once more. A nice float over right into the net. One quick one, two, three. But right at the tip, a tip from Williams needs to send it over right now from Widmarsh right into the chest of Mott. And a point for your Lady Warriors. So checking into the ball game for the Warriors. That's Bethany Jans, a junior for this Warriors team. Williams set to serve here. She has five blocks to date already today in this matchup. Quick serve and hit, but controlled by Hensley. Sent over by our teammate Whitmarsh in a point for Lady Warriors. So Williams set to serve here. Right hand serve. Right into the hole of your Lady Mustangs defense and able to get a quick point, making this a five point game. On the Lady Mustang side, substitutions, that's Madison Krieger checking into the game. As Williams set to serve, right back to that back corner position. Quick serve and hit. That is the Mustang specialty today. You have a quick set and then hit. And a point for your Mustangs, making this a four-point ball game currently. In serving, that's Drury. A nice float over the net. Forward set to Whitmarsh. And to the back court in a point for the Warriors. As well have substitution Roberson checking into the ball game. As teammate Lauren Whitmarsh comes and take a rest. And on the Mustang side, that's Maddie, Maddie Kennedy checking into the ball game for her teammate Alex Mott. So serve coming from your Warriors. Controlled. Forward set. Sent down but rejected at the net from the Warriors. And a point for them. Making this a six point ball game. Probably the biggest margin we've seen today. So great serve coming from Chloe Roberson. Forward set, slight tipped over by Carly Capshay, but not enough to trick the defense of the Lady Warriors and send right into the front line of the Mustangs and a point for the Warriors. And a timeout called by Coach Jones of your Mustangs. Quick timeout coming.
16 to 9, seven point lead right now for your Lady Warriors. The biggest lead we've seen in this matchup. Just a reminder, the Lady Warriors did take game one, 28 to 26. It's still anyone's ball game. We've seen these teams go back and forth, but right now the power is in the Lady Warriors' hands. Chloe Robinson set to serve, sending it to the front line this time in a forward set and a set but blocked by Jans at the net and another point for your Lady Warriors. I think we're starting to see some fatigueness check in for your Lady Mustangs. Just have to fight through it right now but the Warriors capitalizing off of this moment currently. Sent over by Robeson, controlled by the Mustangs. Forward set but blocked and ricocheted off of Defender Warrior. Bethany Jan, so that point will be in favor of your lady, Mustangs. Substitutions coming for Mustangs as Emma Geld checks back into this matchup for her teammate, Casey Price. Set to serve, that's Madison Krieger. With a nice float over to the midpoint. And a nice tip by Whitmarsh. Controlled and sent over by Kennedy. Forward, tipped over by Jens. Uh, got a game of volley. Quick tip by your Warriors to get the point. Ricochet, eight-point lead right now. As we'll have substitutions coming, Lucy Davis checks into the ball game for Cameron Whitmarsh. 18 to 10 right now. Warriors, power is in their hands. Davis with the serve, quick set and send it right over the net, but not enough as Hensley with the tough kill there, but out of bounds in favor for your Lady Mustangs. Carly Capuche set to serve for your Mustangs. Floating right over to the midpoint set. And slammed by Hensley, ricocheting off of the Mustang, one, two, and gotta get it over, they do. Forward set, touched and ricocheted, but still keeping the ball alive, but into the net, the Mustangs go, and a point will go to the, Mus to the Warriors. So checking out of the ball game, Bethany Jens, as Williams checks back into the game. Right hand serve for your Warriors. And just a lot of communication errors going on on the Lady Mustangs side. You guys going to want to clean it up a bit as we're seeing a nine point advantage the Warriors have over the Mustangs currently. So Cullison, right hand serve to the back court, but controlled by fate. And too strong of a look there for Kennedy and a point will go in favor of your Warriors. So Cullison make looking to make it three points here. And just off put setting from Maddie Kennedy on your Mustang side. And this game is getting away from them as your Warriors just breaking away, fighting through that fatigueness right now. It's Cullison set to serve. 3-0 right now. Beautiful right hand serve. Control backwards set to Emma Guild. Ricochet off of the block from Williams. Hensley, sweet spot, but controlled. Williams with the quick tip over. Tip over by your Warriors. Sent back over bounds. So Lady Warriors, two points away from ending this game, too. So Cullison. Looking to go 5 0 here. Mustangs quick set and over. But sent over by teammate Jans. Backwards set. And the miscommunication is killing the Lady Mustangs here. Definitely going to want to talk here as we see Coach Jones a little bit frustrated here as we're at set point. Faith Cullison could potentially end it all here. The nice float over to backcourt. Quick tip over from your Mustangs. And Bella Hensley to seal the deal game.
game two twenty five eleven. Much different play we just saw, and man, that will end game two in favor of the Warriors. Don't go anywhere, folks. We'll be back for game three. And we're back for game three here. Lady Warriors have just dominated game one. They took the win 28 to 26 in game two, 25 to 11. If I was the Lady Mustangs and coach, head coach Jones here, definitely will encourage my ladies to fight through the fatigueness and get the crowd involved. You know, it is homecoming week for your Lady Mustangs. So they have something to prove and the, the support to back them here in this matchup. But the Warriors just feeling every bit of confidence as Coach Witherspoon has instilled in these ladies throughout this matchup and making the necessary calls that she needs to do. And just like that, we've just seen this team dominate on both ends, offensively and defensively. But as we go into game three, Lady Mustangs looking to remain here. It's pretty much survive an event here. But if they do fall to, to this the Lady Warriors will take this match against the Mustangs. So Mustangs will have the first serve. That's Madison Krieger floating it over to the front line. Almost kind of confusing the Lady Warriors, but they're able to retrieve it and send it over by Cullison. Forward set. Nice set by Madison Krieger. Sent right over. But look at this. Right on cue. That's Whitmarsh but still controlled by them and a nice a look there for your lady mustangs that was emma guild on that kill so she will get the first point on the board for the mustangs one thing i've noted this mustang team they're able to always get that first point but just throughout the middle of the game you kind of see that matchup kind of fall a little short 
but a quick tip over the net from Jens. And that point will go in favor of your Lady Warriors. But the Mustangs are going to want to pull everything out of the bag here. They want to remain in this competition. A backward set. Impressive move by her sent over by Carly Capshay, but controlled by your Warriors. Sent right into the chest of Krieger. And sent over with power from Alex Samat. Forward set for your Mustang. Slight tip by Whitmarsh. Sent over by Carly Capuche. Right into the head of Collison. Able to get a point for your Lady Mustangs. So Carly Capuche. You've heard that name all night long. Set to serve for your Lady Mustangs. A nice float over serve from her. Forward quick set and hit, but not quite to discombobulate the Lady Warriors as Whitmarsh is there to send it back. Backwards set, Emma Gild sending it over, ricocheting right off of the block of the Warriors, and a block into the net in favor of the Lady Warriors. Substitutions coming as Whitmarsh will come take a seat as Lucy Davis checks into the matchup for your Warriors. Davis with the serve right-handed. Sent up and over tapped by Victoria Crawford. Backward set from Warriors, something we haven't seen all night. A nice save by the Mustangs, trying to keep the ball alive here. Forward set, Hensley with power down the line. A point for your Warriors. So Davis looking to serve, making it three points here. Server error there, so that will be an advantage of your Mustangs. As Victoria Crawford will be set to serve on the left side. Nice float over from her. Great serving from your Mustangs all night. Hensley with the floater. Tipped Emma Gill, but blocked by Bethany Jans. Make that two for her in this game right now. As she will go take a seat. Teammate Williams, block master for your Lady Warriors. She will check into the matchup as Cullison takes the serving position. Sending it to the back row. Forward set by Krieger. Rejected at the net by your Warriors. Giving them a point on board. Two point ball game right now, five to three. Cullison, right handed serve to the back right side. Nice float over by Alex Mott. Good look for her. But look at this Hensley right on cue with the tip, double tipped by Mustangs trying to keep the ball alive and they will do it the great hustle we're seeing from the Lady Warriors backwards hit over by Williams but the Mustangs keeping it alive but unable to do so as the ball will go out of bounds Lady Warriors man you would think the power would be in the Mustangs hand here but the Warriors not afraid to give it their all here as it has a three point advantage over the Mustangs Cullison sending that one out of bounds error from her point of view. So the Mustangs will be in serving position. That's Emma Guild set to serve for your Lady Mustangs. Right handed serve right to midpoint here. Hensley sending it right into the hands of Carly Capche, able to withstand that power and not enough to make it over the net point for Lady Warriors. Substitutions coming for Lady Mustangs. As Casey Price and her teammate Maddie Kennedy check into this matchup. Also on the Lady Warriors side, checking it back into the game. That's Lauren Whitmarsh for Chloe Robinson. But set to serve. That was Jens. Backwards set. Sent over by Kennedy right on schedule, but Hensley with the slight tip into the hole of Lady Mustangs. His bodies hit the floor. Four point advantage for your Lady Warriors. Now 
Melody Jens. Right handed serve. Just barely nipping the net. Sent right back over with one. And Williams sending it over. But blocked at the net by Ella Drury. Straight to the court. She goes right on cue and on schedule for Lady Mustangs. Kennedy to serve for your Mustangs. Davis with the retrieval as they're moving Hensley just getting the workout in and they'll count it inbound here so a point will go in favor of your Warriors substitutions coming as Davis will take a seat and Whitmarsh will check right back in for your Lady Warriors so set to serve that's Hensley She's been a force to reckon with on the left side of the court, but also from this serving position we saw earlier in game one as she makes it to the backcourt here, but sent right back over, slammed from Carly Capstay, tipped over by Williams for your Warriors, but your Mustang's looking to keep it alive, and just like that, Cullison's able to retrieve it and hitting the left antenna that will go in favor of your Lady Mustangs, a three-point ball game still in advantage of your Lady Warriors. So checking back into that ball game for your Mustangs, that is Taylor Mackle. As her teammate, Ella Drury, sets the serve. Sent over by Hensley from backcourt position. Hensley, one, two, backwards sent over from Lauren Whitmarsh. Forward set, tipped, but not enough as Williams gets a double touch there. Whitmarsh sends it right into the net, so they'll go in favor of your lady. Mustangs looking to rally back here. Two-point game here. As Ella Drury serves right to the front line. Forward set. Whitmarsh sending it over. A little too strong there. One-point game for the Lady Mustangs. Crawling back into this game of three. Because they're looking to stay in this matchup. Drury to serve. As the fans quiet down here. Refs ensuring that all fairness is happening and antennas are set to balance. The referees doing an outstanding job here to make sure a fair and uniform game is being held here. As they check the antennas, left and right antennas here seems as if everything is okay so we'll resume play as Ella Drury set to serve for your Mustangs one point ball game popped up by Williams backwards set and sent right through the hands of defense Lauren Whitmarsh as teammate Bethany Jans checks into the game for Cullison Williams will be set to serve Williams sending it over. Oh. Sent diving inbound and touched and ricocheted by your Lady Warriors. So they'll give that point to your Lady Mustangs. So a bit of confusion on that last play, but no worries. Madison Krieger hit, set to serve. One-point ball game. Attempt to tip it back. That was Carly Capshay, but not enough to get it over the net. So we'll have a sub coming for your Warriors. Chloe Roberson checks into this ball game. Two-point advantage the Lady Warriors have over the Mustangs currently. Roberson sending it over backcourt. Set by forward set, Emily Guild outside of the antenna, so that will go in favor of your Lady Warriors. Robeson looking to make it two here. Sent diving down and out, sent back out of bounds. Making this a four point ball game as we have some subs coming for the Mustangs. As 
Carly Capuche checks into the ball game. And for your Warriors, Riley Stevens checks into the ball game. Haven't said her name much today. Roberson sending things over here. A pop-up for Madison Krieger. Great sets by her all game here. Set and served down by Jens. But retrieved by your Mustangs. Tipped over by Carly Capche. But then look at this. Right on Stevens. Trying to send it back. Sent right back by your Mustangs. Whitmarsh sending it over. But the dive and bodies hitting the floor. One too many hits for your Mustangs. So go in favor of your Warriors. 14 to 9 right now. Five point advantage your Lady Warriors have over your Mustangs. Sending over net but out of bounds. So that point will go to the Mustangs. But a good look right now for your Mustangs as they try to remain in this game. Serve set to come from Carly Capuche. Outstanding player for your Mustangs. Trying to keep her team in here as it rolls right off the net, but not enough to discombobulate Hensley. Sent with power. That was Whitmarsh, but not enough as it ricocheted off of the blocks of the Mustangs. Blocked at the net. Bethany Jans adding to the record books tonight. As Davis checks into the ball game for Whitmarsh for your Lady Warriors. But man, the blocks are real for your Lady Warriors here tonight. Davis, right hand serve. Tipped, tip game at the net. Slight, quick serve and tip. But Hensley, a little power there, but the dive, keeping the ball alive for the Lady Mustangs. Not enough to get the quick three over the net. So that point will be an advantage of your Warriors. Six point ball game right now. Davis set to serve. That's a server error here. She'll reset and make it over the net. Sent over by with power from Crawford. And just like that, a slight tip by Riley Stevens on the slide. Able to get a point for her team. A great effort by her, making this a seven-point ball game. The energy is real on the Warriors bench here as Davis set to serve once more, looking to go to three points. Unable to be controlled by Crawford there. So making this an eight-point ball game, but a timeout called by your Lady Mustangs. So we'll have a quick word with our sponsors here, and we'll be right back momentarily. Eight-point ball game right now. Advantage of your Lady Warriors has just complete dominance. Lady Warriors took game one and two. So if they take this one, it will be the grand finale for them. But Lady Mustangs not going down without a fight here as we see them continuously fight back point after point. But Davis with the serve for the Warriors. So a quick set by Krieger. Sent into the net by Kennedy, but not enough. Nine point advantage for your Warriors as Davis going for five here. Right handed serve for her into the chest of Kennedy. Sent over, tipped slightly by Carly. Hensley with the power, but ricocheted right off of the block. Still alive, tipped over. Trick play by Kruger. A great play by her as we had collision. Of your Lady Warrior, so discombobulation as we have Ella Drury check in for her teammate for your Lady Mustangs. 
So set to serve now. That's Crawford. Sitting it back court, and it is inbound. So that point will go to the Mustangs. Seven point margin right now, but still ample amount of time for your Mustangs to get back into this ball game. But Crawford sending it right into the net. Not enough, but on the Warrior side, that's Williams checking in for Jens. Two big blockers for your Lady Warriors have been substantial for their play here tonight. It's Cullison set to serve. Up and over it goes. Backwards set and tipped over by Kennedy, but retrieved by your Warriors and Hensley. Too much power for her, keeping it in bounds. Nine point game here, four points away for winning it all here for the Warriors. It's Cullison sending it back court. Backwards set by Kruger, but rejected by Hensley and Williams. And the energy is well and alive. A 22 to 12, 10 point game right now in advantage for the Warriors. Cullison with the right hand serve. Sent it to the chest of Carly Capuche, but able to keep it into play here. Hensley with the. Set up here, sending it right back to herself. Mustangs keeping it alive. Emily Gale, a little fatigue there, sending it into the net. And a point for your Warriors. Two points away from sealing the deal here tonight. Allison. Nice tipped over to the front line. Forward set to Kennedy. Dived for Hensley, tipped over um, by Roberson. Guild rolling in the right off of the net. Good play by her, but Williams slight tip right back into the direction of her. And just like that, Carly Cabache doing what she has to do to keep her team into this matchup as her teammate Emma Guild will go to the serving position, but as a 10 point ball game so lady Mustangs want to be in their P's and Q's here set but Hensley rolled rolling right off the block from Ella Drury point in favor of the Mustangs there Mustangs trying to keep it alive here and Miguel sends it over to the back right court forward to Hensley Slammed down but retrieved by the Mustangs and sent into the net by Krieger. It's set point here. So we'll have substitutions coming as Jens and Whitmarsh checks into the ball game. And on the Mustang side, that's enemy jury checking into the ball game. But set to serve here. Melody Jens, she could end it all here. Sent over, set, forward, set, quick tip over from your Mustangs. Sent out of bounds by Whitmarsh. So that point will be in favor of the Mustangs. They're still alive here, but still set point for your Warriors. So Kennedy, set to serve for your Mustangs. You could hear a pin drop in the building, but sent over. Great hustle by your Warriors. Hensley with the tip. But Warriors, Mustangs not giving in to the pressure. Is Kennedy sending it right into the net? And that will do it, folks. 25 to 15 to conclude today's rally for your Lady Warriors. 3 and 0 today. And wow, just impressiveness we've seen from both teams here tonight lady warriors take game one 28 to 26 game two 25 to 11 and game three 25 to 15 great efforts we saw here by both of these ladies and Paige lawrence on the call tonight but that's all we have for volleyball tuesday night until next time good evening